As always, I'm Tess Barrett, and uh, we have two new contestants. Tell us your names and your years at Hamlin. I am Edgar Ojito, and I'm a junior. Tasha Lindbergh, and I'm a senior. Whoop, whoop. My name is Liz, and I am a senior. Nice. Um, you do go to Hamlin, don't you? Usually. <laughs> yes. what, what's, this, what's this betrayal that I spot upon your chest? It's called a birthday present. Moms. Uh, you are? Soraya Bogani. You, what year are you? I'm a senior. And this is Ambush for Answers Piper Trivia. The rules. There will be 10 questions, and you have if you get three wrong, you're out. No smartphones. Put them away. Um, however, you can recover yourself with a bonus question, and you get the opportunity for a shout out for anyone within earshot on campus. And we'll go hunt them down because it's ghost town over here. So, comprende? Si. Okay. First question. Founded in 1209, this famed British university is the second oldest in the English-speaking world and has turned out notable alumni such as Sir Isaac Newton, Charles Darwin, and Hugh Laurie. <laughs> Cambridge? No. Oxford. Cambridge? Both. It's either Oxford or Cambridge. Oxford! 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 Why would you... Oxford. I like that because they have the dictionary. Oxford. Oxford. You're wrong! I'm gonna go with Cambridge. Yes. <laughs> I know. It's the second oldest. Oxford is the oldest. Oh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> hey, listen to the question. Next question. A. A. Milne is most famous for his works detailing the adventures of this honey-loving yellow bear and his group of animal friends. It's Winnie the Pooh! Yes. Winnie the Pooh? The adventures of Winnie the Pooh and Christopher Robin? Yeah. Was, we were taking Winnie the Pooh. 100 Acre Wood. <laughs> it is that poo. <laughs> that specific poo. What's the question? <laughs> Winnie the Pooh. Yes. <laughs> you just asked them what's the question, then you answer it. You're playing recklessly, my friend. <laughs> Owl, rabbit, uh. <laughs> Piglet, tigger, uh, no. And? Eeyore. Yeah, there we go. That's not a question. <laughs> Name three cities that have hosted the Summer or Winter Olympics in the past 10 years. Three? I need three. London? Uh, nope, it's coming up in London, isn't it? Uh. Does London count? Beijing. Vancouver. Uh, Salt Lake City. Yeah! Woo! <laughs> this is a sad high five. <laughs> <laughs> I liked it. Next time, put some more energy in. Please! Salt Lake City. Greece. Athens, Greece. Does that count? Okay. Okinawa. London. And Salt Lake City. Where are you getting Okinawa? <laughs> I don't know. Um, I don't know. That's no. Wrong. Yeah. Th that's wrong. No. Um. 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 I, I give up. Really? Just. Just guess. Just guess. Canada. Where in Canada? <laughs> it is Vancouver, Beijing, Turin, or Torino. Uh, Athens and Salt Lake City. So I got one. What unit of matter is made up of a nucleus, protons, electrons, and neutrons? An atom. An atom. Yep. An atom. <laughs> yes. Chemistry and society, am I right? Chemistry and society. Morgan, Professor Morgan, shout out. <laughs> Thank you, Professor. <laughs> shout out to non-science majors. Name four of the ten most commonly spoken languages in the world today. Chinese is like the most common. So Chinese, English, uh, Japanese, English, Spanish, Mandarin, English, Spanish, French, German. Safe to say. 
Maybe. Let's go with Spanish. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Chinese. Um, One more. German. No. No, no, no. I take it back. Arabic. Yes. Can I get a shout out? Can we? Shout In the middle of a quiz. <laughs> and she's gone. Yeah, she, well, she's on Piper Vision Trivia. And you are her shout out. Name four of the ten most commonly spoken languages in the world today. Right. English, French, no, uh, Chinese, Spanish, um, Arabic. Okay. Yay! <laughs> Thank you. In what year was the Berlin Wall torn down? Wait. Speaking to the microphone, please. Was it? 1989. Yep. <laughs> oh no. Um, can I do a shout out? Yeah. 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 How are we gonna do this? Let's go. F let's go hunt people down. Okay. Who looks like a communist? <laughs> there's a kid. There's a kid. What about these two guys? In true Hamlin tradition, hopefully they're athletes and scholars. <laughs> Gotta ask him. Come on, the, we're running out of. Oh, they're running. They're running away. They're literally running away. Jacket man. Jacket man. So, do you want him? Okay. Hi, we're doing Piper Vision trivia. Can you just help us with one answer? It's her shout-out answer. What year was the Berlin Wall torn down? 1989. There we go! <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. So, ah, all right. Yeah. 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 So you, you're glad you met a German. Yes, I didn't know. Oh, you're German. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we, we ran into a German man. And he was like, why didn't you get the answer? And we're like, you didn't. <laughs> Sorry. And who was responsible for tearing down the Berlin Wall? David Hasselhoff. That is correct. <laughs> What popular English and Indian bat and ball game involves bowling, wickets, and positions such as silly on and silly off? Cricket. Yep. <laughs> you are right. It is cricket. Cricket? Yep. Ah. Merry old England. <laughs> cricket. Cricket. Yep. Oh, it would have been cute if you said it together. Oh, cricket. cricket. And you're wrong! No, you're right. <laughs> no. <laughs> I, almost knocked, I almost knocked down our lamp. Whoopsie! Fake rage. <laughs> Don't pay attention. We're not low budget. What nigh invincible Greek hero gives his name to the body part which caused his downfall? Yeah. Yeah, you got it, whatever. Achilles. Achilles. He was dipped in the river Styx. Achilles. 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 Achilles heel. That's it, that's the one. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yay! <laughs> you struggled, but it was good. It, did. it was a pretty bad struggle right there. <laughs> one, two, three. That's, that's correct. correct. That's wrong, no, okay. <laughs> Again. You're right. <laughs> You're doing great. What musical genre developed in the early 20th century America from a mixture of African and European traditions, utilizing polyrhythm, syncopations, blue notes, and improvisation? Jazz. You got it wrong. No, I'm kidding. You got it right. <laughs> I just wanted to sing some jazz. Can you Squibbly dee, squab -a Can you? No. Jazz, rap. What is jazz? Yeah, jazz. What is jazz? That's my question. <laughs> it is jazz. Oh. <laughs> oh, no. Quintessential jazz. Because you reference Kenny G, you don't get that question anymore. <laughs> We're revoking that point. Jazz, improv, hip hop, sex. No. <laughs> what? Mm -hmm. Kenny G. 
Yeah, and people Kenny there was an audience for the whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> it was full of middle aged ladies. Did, did they have a world record of being the most bored people in the world? <laughs> well, they were all confused the entire time for one single one. <laughs> jazz. Yeah, it's jazz. <laughs> I, I figured I'd say yes before you changed your mind again. It is indeed jazz. <laughs> That's going to be all the next 45 minutes of Piper Vision. <laughs> Gotta find that clip. Gotta find that clip. <laughs> just, just. Me. <laughs> Forty-five minutes. Oh, geez. Last question. Name the movie that matches the quote. This is the three-part question, and you have to get two of the three right. Shoot. Okay. Let's do it. I've got a feeling we're not in Kansas anymore. Wizard of Oz. Wizard of Oz. Yes. <laughs> Wizard of Oz. <laughs> yeah. Oh. I have a feeling we're not in Kansas anymore. Phenomenal cosmic power, itty bitty living space. Aladdin. Aladdin. <laughs> Aladdin. Yay! You got it right. Phenomenal cosmic power. Yeah, you want to hear the last one just for fun? What is this? A school for ants? Uh, that would be Zoolander. We got a movie buff with us. Got a movie buff. Zoolander. Zoolander. What is this? Right. School for ants. <laughs> Zoolander. Yay! What is this? A center for ants. Hey, you won Piper trivia. I've seen like two movies. A three, apparently. <laughs> three are on the list. Lucky day. Yeah. And a winner! <laughs> no, you won! Get out. Ooh. That made a sound. <laughs> the people. Your little individual int introductions, they're always cute. What's your favorite thing? I love not being touched. That's awesome. Piper Vision doesn't yeah. touch you. Because it's not a person. I love the people at Piper Vision. <laughs> Do it less creepy. <laughs> and hold. It's always on. Yay! 24 <laughs> 7 Piper Vision. Twenty-four-seven, Papa Vision. Hey, hey, listen to the question. <laughs>